this down. I got a great panel with me this morning. Conservative radio host Wayne Dupree. And here in the studio, I am joined by the executive editor of Bloomberg View, Tim O'Brien, and Harry Enton, senior political writer at 538. Tim, I'm going to start with you. White House's response is never happened, nothing to see here. Well, they're going to have to back that up then. I think there's going to, you know, we've learned, I think, with this White House that we can't take them at their word often. There's been a number of spokespeople for the White House who have dissembled. We have a president who's frequently dissembled. So I think they're going to have to back that up rather than ask people to take them at their word. What we know here, however, is that there's a long history of Donald Trump uh, soliciting Vladimir Putin during the election. Uh, there's been a willingness on his part to sort of drop kick uh, decades of diplomacy behind the United States relationship with Russia. Uh, he's been in business with people with ties to Russia. So the idea that at face value we shouldn't uh, put any credibility in these reports about contact between, Tim, between his team and Russia doesn't really hold water. Wayne, I want to bring you in. I'm guessing Steve Bannon right now is somewhere saying this is merely the media out to get us. Take the media out of it for a moment. Ryan's Priebus appearing almost to go head to head with the FBI. If this information is coming from the FBI, is that the right thing for the White House to be doing? President Trump himself questioning an agency massively important to us. You know, actually, this um, this information I'm just learning about just standing up here. So I really am. The way that I can speak to this issue is I just heard one of the, um, the individuals on the panel saying it's up to the White House to say that this isn't true. But it's also on the person that's throwing it out to say, okay, this is, this is what we have, this is what it looks like, show some proof instead of just throwing the allegations or throwing everything up against the wall. Throw that up there and then say, okay, now, contradict this. But what you have, you have allegations right now, and you want somebody to say, okay, well, these allegations are, are false. Now, prove the allegations are false. All right, Harry, let's talk about who does what. Ryan's previous has never been part of government. He's a guy from the RNC. 